I'm now joined with Jody Brooks, not only an alumni here at Seton Hall, but also a Hall of Famer. Jody, let's just start simply with some of your favorite memories while playing here at Seton Hall. Absolutely. Um, I think one of the biggest memories here that will forever be ingrained here at Seton Hall is we beat University of Connecticut my senior year here on campus. Uh, Walsh Gym was, you know, just rocking and incredible. Um, and then also our second um, win in the NCAA when we beat the University of Texas. That was just amazing. So both of those, I think, will, you know, be forever in the forefront. I love how you mentioned a rockin' Walsh Gym because even to this day, Walsh Gym just has such great fan electricity in and out. When you're here back on campus for games, how much pride do you have in the program that the fans are coming out in droves? There's so much excitement around Seton Hall women's basketball. Sure. I think women's basketball right now is just like really, really peaking, which is incredible to see. Um, coming back to campus always feels good. You know, it's home away from home will always be that um, and Walsh to me is just incredible. I, I actually am really glad to see the women remain uh, playing in Walsh because I think the atmosphere and the size of it is just um, beautiful. You know when you fill Walsh gym I always say this but to me it's it's our Cameron Indoor you know and and they've always chosen not to go into a bigger arena and we know they could fill that so to me the fact that the women's basketball program here on campus has remained in Walsh um, I think it's beautiful and Walsh is amazing. I love how you also mentioned a little bit of the growth of women's basketball. When yeah. you look at how the sport has grown since your playing days, what are some of the things that makes you more excited for the continued progress of it moving forward? I think it's become more of a level playing field, which has shown like such growth in little girls' interest, um, their development at an early age. Um, you're seeing you know, in my time, there were the great programs, and they were always continuous. And I think to remain at the top is very, very difficult, uh, which you see some programs have done. But we've seen a lot more teams um, escalate and a lot more level playing field with more talent across the country. Um, I took my son to the WNBA championship this past year. I mean, the atmosphere in the WNBA the New York Liberty playing the Aces. Um, it's just like, it's just so much fun to watch right now and see the level of talent across the whole country, really. Jody, thank you so much. Yeah, have, no go problem. have some fun today. You got it. Thank you very much.